And at that day, Ba Gog al Admat Israel. We don't know who is Gog and who is Magog. Some rabbis explain that it's coalitions of few countries. Five countries here, six countries, or ten against eleven. The world would separate to two camps, just when it looks like now. It looks now United States, Turkey, Israel is in between, everyone hates them. And then it's Syria, Iran, Russia, China. The world is splitting to two, the evil power and supposedly the good power. The Gog will come on the land of Israel when my anger will reach the highest level ever. And it says like this, with my zealous, my anger, with fire, I will speak in that day and will be big earthquake in the land of Israel. Big rush, everything will shake. Even the fish in the ocean. That's what we call tsunami. Big waves, the fish don't understand what happened. All of a sudden, five miles, they go left, right, everything is shaking. Even the birds, how are birds get affected by earthquake? They're in the air. There will be such massive winds and storms in the world that even the birds, the chickens, the animals, the worms on the floor, everything in this world will be affected by these days. And all the mountains in the world will collapse. Every mountain, the big mountain, the small mountain, everything will collapse to the ground. Right? All the walls will collapse. The Goim, the nations will all gather together. According to one of the prophecies, Esav and Ishmael will fight one each other before they'll make peace agreement and turn against Israel. Esav is all the Europeans, the Americans, the Russians, the French, Germans, British. They are on one side. And Ishmael is all the Arabs. All the Arabs will fight the Arab Muslims against the Christians. Big holy war, supposedly. One religion against the other. They'll burn the Quran, they'll burn the New Testament. They'll put bombs, terrorists, big war. Many people are dying, and then they say, why are we killing each other? What for? Let's make a peace. It's all the Jews' fault. Benishpati oto bedever uvedam uvegeshem shotef veavne el gavish esh vegofrit amtir alav. Fire will fall from the sky on all the people, God forbid, that Hashem wants to pay them for all their evil ways. The sun will become dark. You cannot see the sun. The moon would look like blood before the arrival of the big horrible day of God. Some things will happen in nature and then the siren will be heard and everybody would understand that's it. Now it's too late to become Baal Tshuva. You want to do something with that? Do!